Yeah, so I have uh, submitted my packet to the board, and I went on my board yesterday. Um, so I just wanted to give a brief sort of discussion of what that was like. My packet, I'm a prior Marine, so I had five years of material that I had to com compile in this packet. You have to get letters of recommendation in. You have to take an ACFT. Uh, or an army fitness test, you have to, um, there was one other big one, oh, flight physical. Yeah, it's a class one initial flight physical. Um, I had taken plenty of those, and you have to, I mean, I had to go to, yeah, I had to go to MEPS as well again. So 35 years old, doing the duck walk uh, in your drawers with, you know, 17, 18 year old kids. That was an experience, man. When I, I went in in 2004 and the kid next to me was born in 2004. So, uh, you know, drop your ego or drop your pride or whatever because you're going to have to uh, do that uh, according to, you know, my state that I'm trying to enter, which is Indiana. And the, and, and they have been nothing but but helpful, so I'm very grateful Although it does help being, again, an older person who's kind of not their first rodeo. I, I have people that I know, peers, just contacts. So my, my recruiter is literally a prior Marine, uh, former air crew. So he and I yell hurrah to each other, you know, every day. And it's, it's a good relationship to have when you're... And, you know, because I tell him, because this poor guy has to do paperwork paperwork and I'm just like hey man send it to me I'll fill it out you can review it you know I try to save him work and save him time uh, so he he doesn't have to because you know it's not a sure thing so you got this what's he gonna put in 40 hours of work on me and then I'm not gonna get it I mean I don't want him to have to do that so anyway um, but he, he doesn't care he's a motivator he's happy to do it he's a, he's a you know phenomenal soldier and, and uh, anyway so yes, I have submitted my packet. It was about 25 to 30 pages. Mine was a PDF, so I just threw, threw everything in a PDF. Um, all that stuff, your sheet from your physical, your ACFT, your letters of recommendation, which I had four or five letters. Um, I, feel like I feel like my packet was solid, but my situation is somewhat abnormal coming in as a civilian with a little bit of a break in between service. So I, I, I hope it was good enough, um, but I do think it was a solid packet. I think I'm a solid candidate um, with, with my background. Then I went to the board yesterday and um, there were four individuals on the board. It was their drill weekend, so I'm going for the guard. Um, and it was, I, th I felt like it went really well uh, I, I believe I'm competing against eight to ten other candidates for two seats. So, I mean, you got to beat out. If it's eight, I got to beat out six people. And, uh, you know, folks putting in for this are not people who are average people. You know, you got to, you got to have, you got to be able to articulate yourself and really sell yourself to this board, which I feel like I gave it a good effort. Um, it lasted about 45 minutes. There were three senior warrant officers, all all warrant officers who were in some sort of command billet. Um, you know, whether that was in charge of a debt uh, or, or some sort of ops officer or something like that. And then there was a, an 05 commissioned officer there as well. Uh, so it was four, four officers and... Um, they asked me general interview questions. You know, what are your strengths? What uh, leadership? What is leadership to you? What type of leader are you? They said, give a, a background of, of your career. They said, um, I'm trying to give you just some. So, you know, here, what, here's what I would recommend. Get your general interview questions down. What are your weaknesses? What are your strengths? Give a description of your career, your qualifications. Um, you know, they did ask me one question on Army Army values. 
Uh, as far as aviation goes, it was more just what's your aviation experience. So I would be I would be ready to art. I feel like I could have done better at that. I I gave a brief sort of. Hey, I, I crewed helicopters in the Marine Corps, and I did three deployments. Well, I feel like I should have been, like, more specific in the weeds, some buzzwords. So I, I was hand-selected by my unit. I passed all the training, on-the-job training, to, to be given my wings. I went to the dunker. I went to SEER training. I didn't go to SEER school, but you still go to SEER training. And then I, I went through high light, low light, um, aerial gunnery. I did a you know, a WTI out in Yuma, like brownout landing, spy rigging, soft deck, parachute ops. I mean, I, I could have done fast roping, landing on ships, uh, insertion of troops and calls for fire and all this. Like I didn't say any of that. I thought it was just implied. And I think that I could have done a better job. External lifts, like, I was well versed in all those things as air crew and I was the I was the most highly qualified AO in my unit by the time I got out. So I didn't say any of that. I just said I did three deployments as air crew. So that's what I mean. Be ready to articulate yourself well. Um yeah, so, but I feel like I made a solid connection with everybody and did a good enough job. There's always going to be stuff that, that you leave out that you wish you could have done better. But that was it, man. I submitted my packet and I uh, went on the board, and they're going to let me know here within the next five to six days. So I really want it. I really want it. So we'll see. You never know. I mean, they could have people that are in their unit that they like and they have a track record of working with these folks, tough to beat that out. Tough to beat that out if they want those people in the unit. Um, but, you know, I was that guy in my unit when I was in. I, they were literally putting in a MESEP package for me, um, for me to go to college, keep my time in grade, keep my time in service, and then uh, commission as an officer and, and be a, an aviator in the Marine Corps. So. Hopefully I did a good enough job of telling them that I literally was that guy and yeah but thanks for your question dude and uh anybody else out there if you have questions leave them in the comments i get my notifications i will respond and wish me luck and good luck to you happy 2022 everybody